You know, in a lot of ways, playing music is like using Lego bricks. Building Lego, making music. You can think of the bricks being a very similar thing to like the frets or the notes that we choose on our guitar or piano or keyboards. We could take different approaches. I would say there's maybe three main categories. We could do all three or one at a time. Some people only do one at a time for their whole life and really focus on those things. So let's imagine, take the Lego analogy. If you were to get your own Lego set, follow a manual step by step, that's one way to build Lego, right? Do, this, do the steps exactly the way the Lego book is built. Another way, the second way of building Lego might be to get the manual and follow most of the instructions, but then change a few things. Or after you've built it, play with it, kind of make it your own. Now you're improvising with the Lego, right? Um, what other things could we do, could do? The third way, you could maybe not use the manual. Get your own bin of Lego bricks, different colors, different bricks. Put them together in different combinations and make your own Lego build. You'd be like a creator or an engineer. But if we imagine that as a musician, we could follow every step. That'd be like trying to copy someone else's music perfectly. Their song exactly the way it is. Maybe we, we learn it different ways. We could get a, a, a song book and work our way through one of these books and watch note by note and do our best to copy exactly the way someone else does it. That would make us a really great performer um, or a cover artist. And that's a great way to play music, but it's one mode, right? A second mode would be to take a song, to learn someone else's song, a cover, try to copy it as close as to them as, as the original artist had it, and then change it, right? Now you're an improviser. You're adjusting that song a little bit, making it your own but you're still kind of taking it from their idea. A third way would be to take your instrument, maybe you know what some of these notes are, you figured out which ones are different colors and different bricks and different blocks, different rhythms, different notes, different chords, different musical elements, just like different Lego bricks or different elements. And you put them together and you compose your own creation or create your own song. So as a musician, my question to you which would you like to be? Would you like to be a, a musician who copies others perfectly, like a Lego builder who follows the steps? Would you like to be the second mu uh, musician who follows the song, copies someone else's song, but then changes it a little bit, adapts it and makes it their own, like an improviser? Plays with other people's music. Or would you like to be more of the third musician that takes your own bricks, like the musical elements, and then you put them together in your own unique way to make your own new song. Some people, they could do one and focus on one of those, maybe their whole life as a musician. Some people could choose to work on a couple, all three. Personally, I really like to focus on all three. And I think all of them, whichever one we do, we're gonna start and we're probably not going to struggle at first. And that's just part of growth and learning. But the more experience we get as either a copier, performer, an improviser, or a composer, the more experience we have with that, the more confident we're going to feel in those areas. So, which do you want to grow in? Let me know in the comments.